hi and welcome back to another video so the foundation works has been completed uh that is in terms of the uh, blocks laying of blocks to it right um height so that has been completed so now what we are doing now is the painting of the inner part of the walls with the damp proof paint so i'll just show you that shortly uh, just to you know help prevent any damps of you know the wall so that is being done here let me just uh, show you and then as you can see we are starting from the very base of the blocks which falls on the concrete so we paint all the way from that section upwards now it is best if you can afford painting the entire foundation with the damp proof paint however that is going to be expensive so what we are doing is we are creating the first we are painting the first three cores of uh, blocks that we have to see if the paint is going to be enough to come up so if once um, that is done and there's going to be more paint then we are going to come up from that particular uh, section so right now we are doing just that part and after that we'll go uh, we we'll do the outside so after the inside we we'll do the outside as well and see where the paint the damp proof paint is able to get to i might say that damp proof paint are quite expensive yeah depending on the brands you're buying depending on the size of buckets you're buying and for what we bought it's not mixed with anything you just have to use the whole thing like that so if you don't use it wisely you might end up using more places that you don't have to so that is also important to take into consideration especially if you are trying to prevent your walls from um, dams so that you, know, you have a very lasting uh, building in the end so that is currently what we are doing and then after that is done we are going to have supply of gravels to fill the entire foundation and then um, the next step would be to soak away water for some time because i don't think it's rained here uh, it's been raining in Accra for some time now especially where i live so if it rains that's going to be a plus if it doesn't we still have work still have to go on so that's what we'll be doing from uh, after the failing is done and after that once the soil is well soaked and compacted well then we bring the ramping machine to you know compact it and then even after that we we'll still will try to water it for some time to see if there's going to be any more soaking so we can compact it again so that you know we have the soil settling properly before we continue with the plumbing work so the plumbing work is going to come after that before we we'll spread the damp proof membrane that is the plastic bulletin throughout the entire foundation and then finally the concrete is going to be cast on top of the entire foundation then we'll wait for some time for it to dry and then we we'll continue with the footing that is laying up the blocks and then we we'll continue building um, the actual house so these are some of the things that are being done um, on the building project um, we had about 20 columns in the entire building all those have been um, cast with concrete the porches has been done that is the front one as well as the back one has been done to their right um, side so normally for porch they don't they have like a, a half block uh, shortage till the actual height of the uh, talent because they normally would want to create a porch having a step down so it's not going to be of the same level as the actual building so that is you see that that is a little bit lower than the actual building so these are some of the things that are being done in case you have any questions or concerns or comments you can just drop them in the comment section and we i try as much as possible to respond and if it's also something that you can all learn from then we get to learn from it so that'll be just about it for this video thank you very much for watching bye for now